Today I went to the United States Holocaust Memorial Museum. I was a tour guide as a youth in high school. It's always uh, an honor to come back and, and uh, reunite with you know the Holocaust family. The benefit of today was an opportunity to experience the Holocaust Museum with a group of law enforcement uh, officers and, and people involved in law, law enforcement and try to look at the events through their eyes. Just being able to teach that information that, that, I, that I've learned so many years ago and watch how it impacts other people and, and watch how they integrate that knowledge into their lives now or into society today. Just to learn about it and actually see the history there is very interesting. To be able to bridge the gap, that's what I love so much about our program, uh, the BTLH program. They challenge you to think. It's not in a group that I, that I know, it's not just my BTLH uh, family, but now, you know, the MPD. My favorite part today was actually the conversation and the discussion afterwards. Good dialogue with, with uh, you know, younger, older, you know, individuals in different uh, capacities. Somebody who's outside of my general community and being able to hear their perspective, it's, it's amazing. It brought a lot of different perspectives into things that I have never thought about before, and it really enhanced my knowledge, not only on the policing side of it, but as well as the uh, history of the Holocaust as well. And the conversation regarding you know, how to bridge the gap between community and police is refreshing and uh, I hope it continues. A lot of people who, who were participating today are community members and then having the opportunity to also work with some of the interns who are involved in federal or local law enforcement activities, uh, being able to engage with everyone around me and hear their perspectives helped shape my own thoughts. And I want to take what, what I've gathered from then, from what I gathered today and, you know, both will make me a better, you know, a uh, change agent within my community. Being able to hear that other perspective and knowing, you know, for, for students, they want to be in the MPD as well. They want to get into this field to change it. MPD is, is, is open and, and growing and it's good to know that MPD is working just as hard as, you know, other folks are on the therapeutic side within the city agencies. To me, that what stuck out is law enforcement failed. Um, it didn't protect the people like it was supposed to and I think what we need to learn from that is how to bring the experiences of the past and where we failed and where we have succeeded and bring that to the future for a better successful police department. It's great to, to see that youth and, and my peers are still proud and, and excited to, to join the workforce to make it for the better.